What's the big color that we can expect on the runway, at runway on the red carpet this year? Well, let me, before I answer that, I mean, let, me sure. just, let me just break it down for people how this kind of works so they sure. know. Every, I would say every year and every award season, it gets kind of more and more, you know, the ante is, is raised. Right. And so what happens, just so people don't, you know, if they don't know how, how it works with these stars, is that one of two things. Um, they get th- dresses that have not been re- out. They're not out yet. Sure. So right now, pre-fall for 2016, <laughs> that's basically, that's basically a, like a year away, right? Yeah. Um, uh, and maybe, maybe spring, although we've been seeing a lot of those already at award shows. Right. So that's one thing. And so a lot of times, um, if they're getting spring dresses, they're not necessarily going to go with this time of year. Mm-hmm. So... That's why you'll see kind of colors all over the place. Right. And then for the really big stars, and I'll talk about that in a minute, you know, they get things that are custom made now by yeah. these designers. They're custom. So forget about stuff that are... That you can get. I mean, somebody will knock that, it off later. That, that yeah. you can maybe get for, you know, $10,000. That's not enough anymore. It has to be a custom. Right. So I think we're going to see, you know, I, I think red is still going to be big, which I mm-hmm. think is always really interesting on the red carpet because it can look great or it can get a little lost. It can look horrible. or I See, and I think that sometimes red vibrates on television, so it makes people look bigger than they are. And I know a lot of actresses don't want to wear red because of that because <laughs> it looks like vibrating. Nobody, yeah, nobody no, wants to big. look bigger.